Oodles of poodles touch the hearts of countless thousands of dog owners. The poodle is elegant and perky, well-proportioned and squarely built. He carries himself proudly with an air of distinction and dignity and a springy gait. Whether he be small, medium, or large, the poodle can steal your heart and steal the show. Welcome to Animal Facts. Let's get started. Number 10. Don't judge a book by its cover. Poodles may look like frou-frou pups, but they were actually bred to hunt. Poodles hail from Germany where they were called poodle which is German for puddle. While poodles today have connotations of wealth and luxury, they were bred to work. The athletic dogs are excellent swimmers and were used by hunters to retrieve ducks and other birds from the water. They have a soft mouth, so they can gently pick up wounded or dead game without damaging it. In France, the dogs were called caniche or duck dogs. Number nine. In 1988, a musher named John Souter entered the Adirondack dog sled race with an all poodle sled team. Unsurprisingly, they didn't do so well. Thanks to matted fur and cold paws, many of the dogs had to be dropped off at checkpoints. The struggle led to a new rule that dictated only northern breeds like Siberian Huskies and Alaskan Malamutes are allowed to race. This measure ensures the safety of breeds that aren't cut out for the extreme cold. In 2010, a California woman wrote a children's book inspired by the story. It's called Sled Dog Poodles, and you can find it linked in the description below. Number 8 Unlike dogs that shed, the poodle will grow fur continuously. As a result, they need regular grooming. If left ungroomed, their fur will become matted and dreadlock-like. On the upside, they're hypoallergenic and generally odorless. Cancel the Febreze order and hit that like button. Number 7 mm -hmm. Elvis loved dogs and had, a, mm -hmm, and had quite a collection at Graceland. When he was stationed in Germany, he had a poodle named Champagne. He also gave away many poodles to women he loved. Yeah, a toy poodle named Little Bit went to a girlfriend and he gave a poodle named Honey. To his wife Priscilla. Number six. An awe-inspiring story of intelligence among this breed lies with the teacup poodle Nala. Although never trained to operate an elevator, Nala somehow figured it out on her own and uses it to visit residents at the local nursing home where her owner works. The small dog can navigate the hallways all by herself and bring comfort to those around her. She'd rather ride it alone than with people because she knows where she's going, her owner said. If she could, she would push the buttons herself. Number five. The poodle, for all its fashionista traits and trends, is actually hiding the brain of a geek. A dog geek, that is. In fact, the poodle is one of the smartest dog breeds. They're also loving, nice to strangers, as long as you keep an eye on them, and have a great sense of humor. All in all, you'd be hard-pressed to find a better game show contestant. Number 4 Poodle enthusiasts make artwork out of their pups. Creative grooming turns poodles into everything from Lady Gaga to the cast of Madagascar. Poodles are the new black. The iconic grooming pattern of the poodle is one that is either loved or laughed at. But it isn't just for fancy looks. These haircuts originated to avoid having wet fur weigh the dogs down while still offering protection to vital areas from freezing marsh water. Number 3 while their ancestry may not be completely certain, it is certain that poodles are an extremely ancient breed. Illustrations of poodle-like dogs have been found in Egyptian and Roman artifacts and tombs dating back to the first century BC. Number 10 Poodles were the most popular breed in the U.S. for 20 years starting in the mid-1950s. However, it wasn't until after World War II that the poodle became popular in the U.S. Before then, they were fairly rare. Before we move on to number 1, please take a moment to like and subscribe. Number 1 in England, Spain, France, and Germany, truffle mushrooms were considered a delicacy and poodles were the ideal dog to sniff them out. Their soft mouths and small paws were gentle enough to not damage the mushrooms. Owners would begin training poodle puppies and their excellent noses to hunt mushrooms as early as four months old. Well, there you have it, 10 showworthy facts about the elegant but sporty poodle. If you'd like to see more lists like this, please feel free to like and subscribe. Also, consider becoming a supporter on Patreon. In the future, we'll be letting patrons pick our new topics and suggest facts. We really appreciate the community that is growing around Animal Facts and look forward to serving you for years to come. And as always, catch you next time. Catch you next time.